first three things that come to mind when I hear the word airsoft. The first one is definitely fun. Yeah. Very clear, I think. Military tactics. Shit, 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 okay, get down. I see three guys. I think one of them is a sniper, two guys with assault rifles. Okay. Got a plan? Lay down some suppressor fire all across the bush, and then I'll push up and you get some fire from the back. Sounds good. Yeah. All right, I'll take out the sniper first. Yeah. Okay. I'm up. All right, ready? Go, 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 move! For me, the last one would be friendship. Shit. Reloading! I think that's the last of them. Nice job. To some, airsoft is just a fun hobby to do on the weekend. But to some, it's much more than that. I would say for some people it's definitely a way of life. Um, you do get the, the, what we call the casual gamers, but then obviously you get people who call themselves airsofters, you know, and that's what they do. They live, breathe, and, and uh, you know, that's, that's their whole thing. That's their focus. Like many other sports or, you know, pursuits, it's something that I think uh, you either do as a weekend warrior or you're very passionate about, you know. So I think definitely it can be a way of life for some people, me included. <laughs> I've met a few people who are really, really dedicated to it. They, they don't just play the sport, they actually like dedicate a lot of their time to promoting the sport and getting the word out there of how fun it is and like on social media, running events like we do every Sunday basically. Um, yeah, it's definitely, it's definitely a way of life. Stay alert guys. Is that a head? Hang on, is that? Oh yeah! Contact front! Moving forward! Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um. Well, personally, I don't do any exercise besides airsoft. Um, I find going to the gym or playing any other sport is kind of boring. Um, airsoft is definitely an exciting way to get your fitness in. The best way to play airsoft is you don't want to be a still target, so you're always moving around and pulling all this gear around, so you're definitely on your toes. I guess the one thing with airsoft too is you only play it as hard as you want to, so there's... Um, there's quite a few people who still come out without the fitness. <laughs> left side. Roger that, left side. Hit. I would say it's as immersive as you want to make it, you know? Um, Firing BBs as opposed to firing anything else, I guess, obviously, apart from real bullets. Um, to me, as far as all of the action shooting sports go, I would say Airsoft is the most immersive and realistic because of the fact you're shooting pellets. For myself, personally, as soon as the adrenaline kicks in when you're in-game, it feels like a real-life situation, and you will do anything and everything not to be shot and have to go back to respawn. Especially if you're playing outdoor and it's a long walk down the hill and a long walk back up, you really don't want to be shot. But yeah, I think part of the fun of a Milsim is actually pretending that you're really there and like the dress up and everything, if people put an effort into it, then it's definitely effective. If everyone's wearing jeans and shorts, it's, you're not really immersed into it. So people buy the gear to look the part, essentially. Um, but you can play in jeans and shirt and just be as effective as the next person. So it's definitely for immersion for other people's sake as well as your own. All right, let's do this. Let's go for a, let's go for a stroll. Whoa, shit. Contact, front! Yeah. Suppressing! Suppressing! 
Fall back! Go, 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 go! Go, move! Dude, the Impsoft community is amazing. Um, the one thing I'll say is that, um, you know, and, and I've been obviously president of a club for, for near on six years now. I think I've been president of war. I've seen literally thousands of people come through the club in that time. You know, we have anywhere upwards of 800 different people a year that play through our club. And 99.9% .9 of those people are amazing, you know? Yeah, I mean, I, I think um, as a whole, the Airsoft community has always been a really fun bunch of people. Um, yep, I'd say it's probably more of a, a male orientated sport at the moment, but it, it's always good to see a few girls coming out and giving it a go and having a great time too. Um, there's always going to be certain people or types that you don't get along with, but I think that's the same with any other sport or anything you do in life really. It's a little bit sort of sceptical at first because I'm a girl and there's actually not a lot of females that play airsoft, so it, it is a little bit sort of scary going into it but everyone is so nice and then you realize that no one really cares whether you're a girl or not so it's a really good community for no matter what age you are no matter what gender you are well my first year in university um i didn't really kind of mesh with anyone in the university didn't really make friends it was just kind of this this different culture and i started playing airsoft because i saw a club at the university and i was like hey Let's try it out. It's going to be something new, something different. My, my airsoft friends and my other friends are chalk and cheese. Let's just say that. I mean, I actually have a lot of friends who don't understand airsoft. Um, there are people who think that I'm, I'm some sort of giant kid getting dressed up like a G.I. Joe and running around in the bush on the weekends. Um, it's not to say that there is a different bond as such, but the one thing I will say is you get a huge bond from your close friends in airsoft because you get that level of... Um, obviously, it's not the same as being in a real war where your people are trying to actually take your life, but you still get that camaraderie. You get that that um, that sense of achievement when you and your team work together and, and get an objective and you take something and you win a game. Um, you know, it's much like, I guess, winning a battle in real life. So there's definitely that bond. So I don't really have airsoft friends, normal friends. And when I do have airsoft friends, they kind of become my normal friends because not only, you don't only play airsoft with your airsoft friends, but you um, you go out afterwards, you go have a meal afterwards, you hang out at each other's houses, play games together. And when I do have normal friends, I'm always like, yeah, you got to play airsoft, and eventually they become airsoft friends. Um, the one great thing I find with airsoft is that it really is a, a great leveler for people. You'll get people who uh, are normally quite socially awkward, that can come to Airsoft and they see a lot of other people who are probably, you know, in a similar boat and, and they get their bond straight away, you know, and they feel like it gives them that connection that to be able to start, you know, it's an icebreaker for a lot of people, um, which is awesome because a lot of times there's not a lot of other things that they can get into where they have that same, um, you know, easily going social interaction. So um, to me, yeah, Airsoft is definitely a, a wonderful thing socially. One push go behind barrels close. Oh. oh, that one. Oh, I see her on the left side. Moving left. Moving back. Right. There would be far too many favourite airsoft moments to, to go back and relive just one favourite one, you know? I mean, it almost seems like every game you get a favourite moment out of that. Um, but, you know, like I said today, um, you know, obviously playing with Vin, my son, on the field, and uh, having him, you know, run across the field under fire and medicking people and, um, and just watching him, you know, go through that process and the joy of that and, and the people reacting to that sort of thing, you know? Like, to me, that's probably one of my favourite moments in airsoft ever actually you know um, it was a very proud moment and and it's those little things I think you need to take from airsoft to make the sport as as wonderful as it is you know get to position okay shit guys they're coming they're coming get ready well right 20 meters out oh no he's still there Loading. covering
How you, how you doing for ammo? Last bag. Oh, great. Training gun. That's a shoot. Get Jordan. Oh okay, shit, right. right side! Contact barrel front. Oh, oh shit! Behind. Oh. Crap! I'm out. Shit! Crap. Yeah. Area clear. Move up. <laughs> 